Hi everyone, this is Dr. Manu Krishnan Ki. We have seen the origin point of certain muscles on the anterior perspective of these two bones, that is the ulna and radius. Now let's discuss the muscle origins from the posterior aspect of these two bones. Here you can see the representation in red markings that represents the origin point of certain muscles. Let's discuss which are those muscles. The first one is on the posterior aspect of the ulna, on the upper part of the shaft, you can see a red marking and right opposite to that you can see an elongated origin point here on the radius. These two corresponds to the origin point of abductor pollicis longus muscle which helps in the abduction of the thumb. And right below that you can see the second muscle origin that is that of the extensor pollicis longus which helps in the extension of the thumb. So this is abduction of the thumb and this is extension of the thumb which are aided by these muscles. And opposite to that on the radius on its posterior surface on the middle part you can see here this particular point is the origin point of the muscle named as the extensor pollicis brevis with a shorter tendon than that of the longus. And opposite to that particular one, you can see another attachment here on the ulna that represents the origin point of extensor indices which goes towards the index finger. So now let's see the movements of each of these particular muscles. So when you consider the first one, the abductor pollicis longus. So how is the abduction of the thumb? The thumb is pointing away from the plane of the palm. You can see it's going downwards. So that is abduction of the thumb facilitated by the abductor pollicis longus. Then we have the extensor pollicis longus which helps in the extension of the thumb that you can see here. And the next one is extensor pollicis brevis which is also taking part in the extension of the thumb. You can see the extension of that particular tendon there. And right on the opposite side, we have the next one that is extensor indices, which is exclusively for the index finger and you can see the extension of the index finger happening there. So these are the muscles on the extensor compartment commonly originating from these points.